Today we gave a warm welcome to an old friend. For the first time in two and a half weeks, we are finally seeing the sun. We know that 10 to 15 minutes of sunshine a day can have some health benefits like helping us get vitamin D. But does a day like today count? Can the sun give us enough vitamin D in the winter? Good question. Heather Brown enjoyed the afternoon outside. What do you think about this day? Oh, it's so beautiful outside. Fantastic. I'm taking out my longboard because you don't get many of them. It's beautiful. Blue skies. You're walking. You just stick your face up into the sun because you're so happy to see it. The sun never fails. It's always a better day when it's sunny. It helps us produce serotonin, a mood-lifting hormone. <sighs> I'm so happy. I'm so happy today. And allows our skin to synthesize vitamin D. It's really important for calcium absorption of the food that we eat. It's really important for your sleep-wake cycle. It's supposed to boost our immune system in a positive way. April Chu is a nurse practitioner of integrative medicine. Do we get enough vitamin D in the wintertime? Generally, no. So here's the thing about vitamin D. We need the UVB rays from the sun so our skin can produce it. And in the summertime, the sun is high enough in the sky that those rays will get to us. But in the winter, the angle of the sun is too low that the atmosphere blocks the UVB rays. Most of us need to supplement. So what should we do? So the best thing to do is go to your provider and get your blood checked to see what your level's at. How much do you take? I don't know. I have a <laughs> bottle of it and I couldn't even begin to tell you. That's a good way for us to decide how much of the supplement you should be taking. Some foods, salmon, eggs, can give us vitamin D, but Chu says it's generally not enough. Even if we drink five glasses of milk a day, Right. Are we getting enough vitamin D in the summertime? It depends if what kind of job you have. Sunscreen and windows can block our vitamin D too. Best to get out now because the bottom's about to drop out. <sighs> I don't want to talk about it. And that looks like it's going to be our coldest Christmas in about 20 years. Urgh. But at least it'll be sunny. It's nice to say, hey, it's a pretty day outside. So. Right. Heather Brown <laughs> from inside. Exactly. WCCO exactly. for news. Well, if you have joint pain and you don't feel like yourself in the winter, our expert says check with your doctor about vitamin D. How much you take will depend on your level, size, and color of your skin, but be careful because you can take too much vitamin D. If you have a good question for Heather, please email it by going to wcco.com links.